Nick Buckley joins me now, who is author and charity founder, Nick Buckley MBE. Nick, thank you very much. It's going to have to be very short and sweet, I'm afraid. Yes. What on earth did you make it that? Because a lot of people are going to say, hang on a minute, charity starts at home. We're heading towards tent cities full of migrants in local parks here, judging by what I've heard in the House of Commons. Well, watching that debate has just depressed me. Have you ever seen a debate like that for buff sleeping in the UK? Have you ever seen a debate like that for the grooming gangs and trying to protect working class girls from being raped? Why do we always care about foreigners more than we care about the people who live in this country? And what I noticed really in the House of Commons was it was full of managers. Everyone is just trying to manage the status quo. And what we need are leaders. Leaders who say, I'm changing this. I'm leaving the European Court of Human Rights. I'm leaving this institution because I'm starting again. I'm going to put the British people first. But we don't have that. We just have managers who go, we just need to tweak this and tweak that. Get some more hotel rooms. None of this fixes anything. And that mm. was a disgrace of a performance of the House of Commons today. And actually, I'm sorry I've come on because watching that has just depressed me and ruined the rest of my, my evening. Nick, your views there are not uncommon in my inbox. Sat here fuming, says Jim. Nick, that was short and sweet. I hope you can understand. I've got to go to Michelle Jubilee now, yeah. but I would love to continue this conversation with you tomorrow if that's all right. We'll sort that out behind the scenes. Nick yeah. Buckley, MBE there, author and charity founder. Goodness gracious me, ladies and gentlemen, what did you make of that?